Hi, and welcome to another edition of the Giving Project for Children's Read Alouds. Today's story is one of our recent favorites, Hair Love by Academy Award winning creator, Matthew A. Cherry, and illustrated by Vashti Harrison. This is an incredible story, a very simple story about a girl and her daddy and the lengths that he'll go to to try to make her happy. This also recently won the Oscar and it's incredible. So I am going to attach today's short film, the short film of the book. It's a seven minute long short, which won the Oscar. So please enjoy Hair Love by Matthew A. Cherry. Our themes today are family and love. Hair Love by Academy Award winning creator, Matthew A. Cherry and illustrated by Vashti Harrison. My name is Zuri, and I have hair that has a mind of its own. It kinks, coils, and curls every which way. Daddy tells me it is beautiful. That makes me proud. I love that my hair lets me be me. In funky braids with beads, I am a princess. And when my hair is in two puffs, I am above the clouds like a superhero. My hair even does magic tricks. One day, Rocky and I were playing outside when along came the rain. From large to small, it went presto, just like that. There's nothing my hair can't do. Today I woke up extra early, all by myself. I was too excited to sleep. It's such a big day. I like that the cat is thinking about food. <laughs> Daddy is still sleeping. Shh, I say to Rocky as we tiptoe past him. Lately, Daddy has been extra worn out. He makes me breakfast, takes me to school, goes to work, picks me up, and yesterday we went for a bike ride around the park. I think he needs a break. So look, she made him breakfast. That was a really, really kind thing of her to do. Because today is special, I want a perfect hairstyle. This calls for a professional's touch. She's on the iPad. <gasps> Crack! Pause off, Rocky! Daddy heard the crash. Zuri, what on earth? He asks. I was only trying to help, I said. Daddy smiles. Can I help too? It'll be a piece of cake, Zuzu. The first style was a big no way. The second was no better. No, Daddy. Then Daddy tried slicking my hair back into two puffs. Ouch! Daddy yelled. The rubber band smacked off and hit him. Wait a minute, Daddy said as he reached into the drawer and pulled out a pick. Ta-da! Daddy. Really? I said. I'll be right back, he promised. Now, how's that? He asked, pulling a hat down over my eyes. Daddy, come on, we can do better than that. I really need my hair to be special. Don't worry, he said. We'll figure this out. She's so sad. He's comforting her, making her feel better. Then I had a great idea. Daddy gathered all the tools we needed, and we were all set. Well, that's a lot of stuff. Watching carefully, Daddy combed, parted, oiled, and twisted. <gasps> he nailed it! Funky puff buns. Pretty, pretty and so much fun. Rocky approves too. I put on my superhero cake as the final touch to a perfect look. Click. I wonder what that is. Where's my Zuzu? Mommy called from the door. She could not get in the house fast enough. Mommy! You have got to be the prettiest superhero girl I've ever seen, she said. And your hair is beautiful, Zuri. Who did it? I looked at Daddy and he beamed. Welcome home. Mommy smiled. Very nice. Thank you. We learn from the best. Daddy gave her a big hug. My hair 
is mommy, daddy, and me. It's hair love. In this story, Zuzu's daddy works so hard to create the perfect hairstyle for her. Today, I want you to think about something that your grown-up does to go above and beyond to make you happy. I know that there are certain things that I like to do for my kiddo just to make sure that he feels extra happy and extra special inside. So today, after you've thought about that thing that that grown-up does for you, I want you to either go thank them for that, show some gratitude, or you can draw a picture of them and you. I'd love to see these pictures. So please send them to me at thegivingprojectforchildren at gmail.com or post them on social media and tag us in them. I love sharing these books with you. Thank you for sharing Hair Love by Matthew A. Cherry with us. And let's continue to develop our love of reading together. Till next time.